Okay, I'm going to demonstrate how to determine the size of a feature in a micrograph using the scale bar in a micrograph. Okay, so if I look at this micrograph, um, there's a, a part here, and this is the, uh, there's also the scale bar. So let's say we measure this part with a ruler and obtain a measurement of um, 7.25 centimeters. Okay, and now we go and measure the micron bar or the or the scale bar down here and see how long that is. Let's say that that with our ruler we measure a distance of 4.53 centimeters. Now, according to the uh, the notation here, it says that this scale bar is actually represents a length of 500 microns. So this results in an equivalent statement: 4.53 um, centimeters is equal to 500 microns. We can use that equivalent statement just like any other conversion factor in doing a unit factor conversion. So if I take my the feature I really want to know the size of, which is the size of this part, and that was 7.25 centimeters, and set up my fraction for unit factor conversion, I'm going to put um, centimeters on the bottom so that'll cancel centimeters on the top in this one so I have 4.53 centimeters on the bottom and then in order to be able to do this I can't just multiply this number by anything I have to multiply it by one since these two are equal to each other the ratio of them is equal to one so um, I have to put 500 micrometers or microns on top. And so um, then I'm going to uh, do the math for this. So I'll bring over my calculator and 7.25 times 500 divided by 4 0.53 and enter that and I have a value of 800. And the centimeter units cancel and the units that are left are micrometers. So it's 800 micrometers, or 800 um, microns is the size of that part. Now I also know that um, I could convert this to millimeters, 800 micrometers, times, um, I know that there are 1,000 micrometers in one millimeter. So that's equal to 0.800 millimeters.